Hey, horror fans, once again, it is me, the Horror Minds of Money. Gee, yes, you know what today is? Yes, it's Saturday, and that means it's Slashback Saturday. And for this Slashback Saturday, the Horror Man Joe said that we have to do a slasher that takes place maybe in an amusement park or carnival, something that has something to do with that aspect. And I thought, what a better way than to talk about that one would be Final Destination 3. <laughs> Now, Final Destination 3 is a 20, 2006 American supernatural horror film that was directed by James Wong. It is a standalone to the Final Destination 2, and it's the third installment of the Final Destination film series. It stars Mary Villist and Weinstead, Ryan Merriman, and it takes place years after the first film. Now, Weinstead plays Wendy Christensen, a high school graduate who has just had a premonition that a roller coaster she and her classmates are riding on will derail. Oh no! Although she saves them from, although she saves some of them, death becomes hunting the survivors. Wendy realizes photographs she took at the amusement park contain clues about her classmates' deaths. With survivor and friend Ken Fisher, Wendy tries to use this knowledge to save the rest of them and ruin death schemes. Yes, that's what this movie is about. Now, obviously, the reason why I picked this one because it takes place during a carnival. We see Wendy and her friends take out on this ride called Devil's Triangle, and she has a premonition, like all people do in this particular series, that they're all going to die, and they're going to die on the roller coaster. Now, she saves some of them, and of course, roller coaster has a dilemma. Most people die. But unfortunately, people also start dying, mainly some in the manner they would have died on the roller coaster. And that's basically what Wendy and her friend tries to do, is to save all of them uh, from death's grips. Now, as usual, when it comes to the Final Destination, Final Destination series, we get a lot of crazy deaths. There's this one particular scene where two girls get died while sun tanning. <laughs> <laughs> you got to give them credit. These people, these filmmakers who do it, they come up with some very inventive ways of how to kill people. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the things I truly love about this series. But like this one, in this one right here, uh, which sort of continues, continuations, it actually continues off from the first movie where one of the survivors talks to Wendy's character about the plane crash that happened in the first film. And how after that plane crash, some survivors, mostly all the people who survived the plane crash, died. Of course, uh, vet horror veteran Tony Todd once again appears. This one, he's the voice of the Devil Triangle. And he also plays a paramedic too. Well, which of course we all love. But you guys just love this film. Some great practical effects in this particular film. Some inventing ways of how people die. I mean, you just love, I mean, you just got to see it. So there you have it. That's my uh, review of Final Destination 3. Uh, have you guys seen it? What do you think about it? Do you simply just love this particular series? Where would you rank it on the other part of the other ones in this series? Uh, leave your comments in the comment section below and tell me what you thought about Final Destination 3. Now, obviously, next Saturday is Halloween. And for next, for the next Slash Fact Challenge, Joe the Horror Man said we have to pick a slasher that includes mask. Not that the fact that the killer has to wear a mask, but that anyone in the film has to wear a mask. So that's going to be an interesting one. I have a few things that I have in store, but that's going to be for next Saturday Slashback Challenge. So once again, that's my video for today, guys. Hope you did enjoy it. And if you did, please give it a thumb up, likes, and share. Also, if you're new here, please hit that subscriber button and ring that notification bell. That way you'll be notified anytime when I put up new videos such as this one. Once again, my name is Lamont Smith, better known as the Horror Miser Money G, and always remember that horror rules! And I'll see you in my next video. I am out.